Value Trades. Welcome to this week's Market Blast Technicals. Hi, I'm Brad Alexander, and on behalf of Value Trades, let's take a look at platinum, dollar yen, and gold. Yesterday, we looked at gold from the fundamental standpoint, and the market still sees downward pressure, even though price has risen above $1,800. From the technical view, we see price at the upper trend line in this bearish run, so we will wait for confirmation before going short. For this, we can wait for a bounce or use another technical indicator like the stochastic oscillator, which is now showing us overbought. We can also add another like the parabolic SAR and wait for a bearish signal. If you want to know more about how to use these indicators, I've added a link at the end of this video. Last week, we looked at dollar-yen on the daily chart and how price action broke this year-long downtrend. On today's 4-hour chart, we see price just touching the lower trend line and the stochastic oscillator showing oversold. However, please watch the fundamentals on the US dollar as the US Congress should be voting on the next COVID stimulus package of this week. Last week, we looked at the rise in platinum and we see that price did in fact rise, but we are now seeing a consolidation pattern in this symmetrical pennant. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and register on the Value Trades website to get notifications on new content as it happens. That's all for now. Happy trading with Value Trades and we will see you later in the week with our trading tips video. CFDs and FX are leveraged products and your capital may be at risk.